The African Court of Human Rights Commission in Gambia has directed the Kenyan government to halt the exercise of evicting residents from the Masai Mau forest pending a hearing and determination of the case. According to AU, uh, this is the year for refugees and uh, forced displacement. But unfortunately, Kenya did exactly the opposite uh, by creating uh, internally displaced uh, persons. It's what that order means. Life should be possible. Uh, in fact, the order talks of right to quiet enjoyment of property until the case is determined. According to Duncan Ojuang, a human rights attorney, the operation led by the Ministry of Forestry could hamper the country's chance of getting a non-permanent seat at the United Nations Security Council due to flouting human rights laws. And the AU uh, have put or have thrown their weight behind Kenya. Uh, so that it can secure the position in Security Council. Uh, that position, or even the bid for that position, come with serious responsibilities, but, but I think this will be a, a greatest test. The Commission urged the Kenyan government to stop the eviction until the case is heard and determined. About 60,000 residents live in Mao, and the Commission has directed the state to refrain from interfering with the residents' rights. Is uh, people being kicked out, houses being burned, a uh, few people uh, walking with pots and tying things on their back and, uh, and, and, and chicken and whatever. And you want to create this image, Kenya here are the people who are destroying your forest. We know uh, of even companies that still do logging in that same mall during the night. During the day, you go blame uh, people who look helpless. Even generally what a document from government means, that a document from government, even according to our court, is presumed to be legitimate unless you prove otherwise. And it is up to you to go to court and, sh and show the court that it was procured using fraud. So you can't be in a press and simply say those title deeds, I don't recognize them, they are papers. President Uhuru Kenyatta's government has four days to respond to a letter sent to him by the commission on 9th of November in regards to the eviction. Abdiaziz Hashim, Ibru TV.